craft beer nerds. Welcome to Out of Here Having a Pint. My name is Kevin. This is Kelsey. And we're gonna drink some beers today. Guess what? North, North Carolina, Carolina beers. beers! So the very first beer is a special beer because it's from Asheville, North Carolina. And if you're not familiar with Asheville, North Carolina, get familiar because it is a beer city. Ooh, beer is city? Because it's not a fad, it's a lifestyle. Everywhere you go, you're gonna like run into breweries. We visited North Carolina, Kelsey, and guess what? What? I ran around the town. I ran around the town of Forest City. We actually got these beers from Twisted Pear in Forest City. And uh, got to say shout out to Justin Connor out there. Happy birthday, bro. But anyway, three beers, Forest City, Twisted Pear. Check this out. Awesome, awesome little town, right? Yeah. All right, my favorite part of the video. Let's get to drinking. Ooh, it's a French broad, we heavy. We heavier. Oh, we heavier. I'm sorry. Uh, from Asheville, North Carolina. And what is it? It is a mm. uh, Scotch ale, seven percent alcohol by volume. Ooh, Scotch ales. No. Uh oh, somebody's gonna get in my pants tonight. No, I'm just kidding. Highly carbonated. I wonder if you can see that color there. It's got a nice head on that. We got our own glasses this time, Kelsey. So you go ahead. You uh, you uh, have a sip. Look at all that head. That's what she said. It's nice. It's like uh, really light. I thought it was going to be much heavier than that, but um. I mean, so do you like Scotch I, I do now. I don't know, really, seriously though. Um, I haven't really dived into. Yeah, you. I never run into Scotch ales. Even when we go to the different uh, festivals, we don't run into. I don't know why my voice just got that high just a moment ago. So for a beer that's called We Heavier, this it's is really lighter heavy. than what I thought it was gonna be. This is true. We heavier my ass. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can't. We, you, we can't jump to the other beer yet until we do our thing. All right, Kelsey. Would you have a pint? I would have a pint. I would have a pint of that. Beer number two. I think this is called Kawi Coffee Stout. Kawi. Hey, if we pronounce that beer wrong, um, send us a comment on our YouTube channel and let us know that we are a bunch of R cards. And that's a medical term, by the way. Okay, this is a coffee milk stout. Now, it is from Curahee Brewing in Franklin, North Carolina. Yeah, and it is also 7% alcohol by volume. You know, look how dark that is. Look at that. That is beautiful. That is a beautiful head on that glass. Mm -hmm. you drink that shit or not? Okay, I'm, I'm getting prepared, man. You just can't go right into a big head like that. You have to ease into it. Mm -hmm. You could, man, that, yeah, that is thick. That is a thick, and I like thick. Wait, wait. <laughs> Hold on. Uh... I like a milk stout when it has a thick mouth. There's no way I'm. There's, there's no way I'm gonna avoid this. It's a, it's a thick mouth feel. That's pretty good. Now this I would drink in the winter time. It is like 40 degrees here, so this is perfect for me right now. Ooh. Do you think you like it because fireplace. you like coffee, or just because you like the taste of that beer? Because I like thick. It's because I like both. I like coffee and I like, you know. It's also very um chocolatey. Yeah, like chocolate. Uh, who doesn't like chocolate? And who doesn't like coffee? And um, where's this from? Some people. Gotta turn it around. Franklin, North Carolina. 
Curry Brewing Company. I really hope that I said that correctly. Because this is an awesome beer. Alright, I'm already tipsy. Why do you get to have all of this? Oh, okay. We almost forgot. Uh, would you have a pint of it? Yes. Multiple, all right. Multiple pints. Would I have a pint of it? Yes, I would definitely have a pint of it. I have more than a pint of that. I like that. That's awesome. Especially in the winter time in the cold. It's great. To beer number three, Old Chubb. If you have not tried Old Chubb, I do not think that you're a true craft beer person. You just can't keep using that. <laughs> Alright, so Old Chubb is a Scotch ale. It is from Oscar Blues Brewery in Brevard, North Carolina. It's another Scotch ale. We have two Scotch ales on the board. Yeah. Hmm. And this is 8% alcohol by volume. And I think I, I think I am tipsy. Who says tipsy anymore? I don't, nobody says tipsy. That's 90s. Yeah. I think it's the me, yeah. Because I'm old chub. So this is going to be a battle between old chub and heavier. We heavier. Yeah. All right, let's try it. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Okay. This tastes like something, and I cannot put my finger on it. It's almost candy-ish. It's sweet. It's very sweet. And I'm like spitting everywhere, like a freaking faucet. Keep it in your mouth. You see where this theme? You see the theme of this video? Oh, chub. Huh. All right. Would you have a pint? No. Why not? I do not like. Yeah, it's a little bit sweet for me, um, but it is good. Don't get me wrong. This is a good beer. It's a good beer. It's it is. not an amistad. Right. So, yeah, we're not, when we go through these, we're not saying that these are bad beers. We're just saying that we wouldn't have a pint of it. But we want to know if you would have a pint of these. And if you ever tried these, make sure that you comment on our YouTube video down below. Tell us if you would have a pint of three of those if you had these beers before. Okay, so which Scotch Ale is the winner here for you? Well, nobody asked me if I would have a pint. I would not have a pint of this because one, it is very sweet to me. It is very strong and it's just not my, it's not my style. I don't, Scottish Ales are okay. I would have that Scottish Ale, French Broad, because it's a little bit lighter it's not as sweet, and yeah, I think French broad wins. Broads always wins when I'm like judging. So which one would you continue drinking? I would say the Milk Stout is the winner out of all these three, and uh, congratulations. Uh, I hope you can see that. I hope I got that in there. Kirihi Brewing Company, the Kawi Coffee Stout. All right, until next time, you little craft nerds, we're gonna see you later. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like our videos. The next video, I don't even know what it is. I know I promised brew dog beers, but that hasn't happened yet. There's so, a lot of brew dog information. There, that we, have. we have a lot of brew dog beers, and yes. we are sponsored by brew dog. <laughs> Wait a minute, no, we're not. <laughs> what the hell? Brew dog sponsored. Thank you, little nerds, for watching, for spending time with us, and we'll see you next time. Woohoo!